Hi, my name is Kimberly Madsen. I decided to come here to Vitality because I saw the sign that stated, get to the root cause of your thyroid problems. And since 2011, I've had an issue with hypothyroidism. And then the hypothyroidism led to uh, other uh, health issues that I was having. I had fibroids and so I had to get a hysterectomy in 2016 and then being postmenopausal your thyroid still doesn't work as well as it did and so I would try different diets. I tried the Nutrimost diet that had great success but um, I gained weight back and then after my hysterectomy and so because of the menopause and then after I tried the Nutrimost diet, then I went on to try the um, weight loss, medical weight loss center diet, and I was successful in losing the weight there as well. But then when I started introducing the foods back in, I would find myself still achy and sore and gaining weight. It wasn't until here at Vitality that I was tested for food sensitivities. I was tested for um, amino acid imbalances and the like, and I was tested for actually Hashimoto's thyroiditis. So since 2011, I have been being tested on an annual basis in my blood tests, uh, either twice a year, uh, four times a year in the beginning, then it was twice a year, now it's once a year. Never was I ever diagnosed with Hashimoto's thyroiditis until here. And it made a lot of sense because I was sore, I was achy, um, I had arthritis, I was very sleepy, I just didn't want to feel like socializing much. And now I feel like some of that activity is coming back. I can actually work out and not feel too sore afterwards because with thyroiditis you get the the aches and the and the swelling and you just don't feel like you have much energy and I was taking supplements too that were counteracting my thyroid overworking my thyroid because I did not realize that food sensitivities would have such an attack on your body I heard, I had heard about um, the uh, high fructose corn syrup and and the negative effects of that on your body but I've never had an extensive testing process that got to everything that needed to be handled. And then I find out too that my high cholesterol and slash low cholesterol balance was actually worse than I thought it was. Um, I had been told that it wasn't, it was, it was, the high cholesterol was high, but because the low cholesterol was um, not too far of the spread between your high cholesterol and your low cholesterol, I was still okay. And that actually wasn't the case either. And so now I'm taking some medicine to counteract the cholesterol to get back to health, back to a good state of being for my heart and also uh, getting those cholesterol levels down as well. Some of the supplements that I was taking, I did not need and that was done through kinesiology testing and actually ended up saving me almost $250 a month on supplements, so that was huge. And I just really enjoy the holistic perspective that Dr. O provides here because he takes a look at the kinesiology, he takes a look at um, your blood, your hair, your um, fasting, uh, testing as well so I would highly recommend anyone who's been trying to handle it on their own or trying to test their uh, specific ailments on their own to talk to Dr. Osterhout talk to the team because they will take a look at everything and they will help you get to the bottom of anything that you're dealing with I mean we see people who are constantly at the gym, working, 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 but if they're not getting down to the root cause, they're only defeating their efforts. They're, they're not intentionally putting their energy where their energy needs to be spent. Because in one month, I lost seven pounds of inflammation. I've lost my weight due to inflammation and also staying away from those food sensitivities that I have and, and having
having substitutes for those food sensitivities because you can do this, it can be sustainable if you know what right substitutes you can utilize. So you don't have to become a full-blown vegetarian. Um, you can have those substitutes, but you do need to add more vegetables into your diet. And then the interesting thing that you find is that you don't have as many cravings either because the vegetables have so much, so many nutrients in them that it helps keep the, um, it helps keep the, uh, keep your body from craving things that it needs because it's, it's a uh, balance. It's, you know, it has that nutrition there. Um, so the, the aspects is that you know there may be some some items that are out of pocket for you to pay but if you're spending so much money a month on supplements it almost balances itself out so it's it's smarter to come here get those tests have the supplements that you need and not the supplements that you don't need and stop wasting your time and your efforts and your money on practices that you don't need that are not good for your body because everybody's um, makeup is different. Our bodies do have the ability to heal themselves. Your thyroid is not going to be burning up and will be gone like the medical doctors like to tell us. And so the body can heal, the thyroid can heal, and it can come back to optimal health. And so that's what I'm currently working on right now. Um, I would still be doing the same things if I hadn't decided. I'd be wasting money, I'd be sore, I would be asked to go to the gym, but I don't feel like going to the gym because I know that I'm just gonna hurt and it's not gonna do a darn bit of good anyway. Because when you have these inflammation issues, your body does not heal properly. And so you have to first get rid of the inflammation and then you can start working out, start uh, increasing your health, increasing that workout on a weekly basis, um, do things in a gradual, uh, instance so you don't hurt yourself or you don't um, hurt any of your ligaments or muscles or anything like that. Um, I the, the overall benefits that I received in just quickly a month and a half, I started the, pro, uh, the program in, on June 6th and the, the difference in myself has been that I feel like I'm less sore I eat better, I don't have as many cravings, I sleep better, I wake up earlier, and I have more energy throughout the day. And so that feels tremendous to me. Um, the inflammation's going away day by day. I mean, each morning I wake up, I take a look in the mirror, I see results, and so it's very good. The, the results are, are very um, impactful because you see yourself making that progress, and so it keeps you motivated that way. Um, that you're, you, but you have to follow the instructions. You have to listen to all of the doctors and what they say because if you don't follow it and you don't listen to the guidance, then what are you spending the money for? So uh, I, I urge every, if people who are interested in finding a difference for themselves to trust the process because the process is good. It's intentional. You're not doing something that is a waste of time. You're going to get down to the bottom of your health issues. And it was sad to find out that I had Hashimoto's. I had a little day of, you know, uh, you know, it just was sad. But at the, at the same time, I know that there is a pro process that I'm going to go through that it's going to reverse this because our bodies are capable of going back to optimal health. And that's, that's my goal. And I urge, you know, I've been talking to my friends and family about their um, different uh, items that the gut, you know, most of our uh, issues are with leaky gut. And a leaky gut can happen in the children too. And that's why we see more children having diabetes now. So um, I, I urge everyone to, to think, you know, for themselves, our health is our wealth at the end of the day to ensure that we have a good, long, prosperous life we need to have that health be optimal and at its best. I'm Kim Madsen and I highly recommend Vitality Healthcare.